What's up guys, this is JC and welcome to ETG Reviews. First thing first, I just want to say rest in peace to Wyndham Rotunda, aka Bray Wyatt. He was a phenomenal wrestler, a great storyteller, and he was well loved by the WWE Universe and also his family and friends. I remember when he first came out as Husky and he changed himself to Bray Wyatt and the last we know him as The Fiend. Great storyteller, great gimmick, he was an awesome guy. Well loved, well respected, going to be well missed. And we got the Firefly running in your honor, my man. This right here you're looking at is the Xiaomi Pad 6. And this is an awesome tablet. I'll just be using it for a little bit. And for the short time I'll use it, I'm very impressed with it. Support Dolby Vision Atmos. And this bad boy comes with two different storage capacities. 128 and 256. Both got 8 GBs of RAM. And the one for 128, 128 GBs of storage goes for 354, and the 256 version goes for 397. No SD slot for expandable storage, so many apologies for that. This got this got a beautiful um, IPS panel screen, 144 Hertz refresh rate, WQHD plus eye care display. What's running this tablet right here? Snapdragon A70 flagship processor. This thing is a beast. It comes with four speakers and it comes with also a very good, very sizable 8840 ampere battery that, that um supposed to be run all day. But when you're gaming on this thing with a beautiful Snapdragon A70 chip, even though it's an older chip, it begs to differ. Anyhow, it comes with a 33 watt fast charging brick and this is an international version. So when you get it, you're going to come with this 33 what brick right here with this adapter boom you're good to go not only that it comes with a 51 watt hard charger that is crazy that is crazy and also it comes with a usb type a to c cable as you can see got an orange inside to represent the, the miui on on top of it it's running android 13 with the miui 14 skin on top beautiful stuff I think I mentioned the colors. I don't think I did, but let me go ahead anyhow. It comes in four colors. Gravity Gray, Gold, Champagne, and Miss Blue. And this one right here is Miss Blue. With a beautiful 2K screen. Right here in the camera. The front camera is an 8 milliampere camera. And the back right here is a 30 milliampere camera with a flash. Pretty decent stuff. So you see for the four cameras, you got two right here on top. And two right here on the bottom pretty stuff for the usb type c it comes with three three microphones one on the bottom and two on the side and right here you can attach the pen that's so separately you got a volume rocker right here on the side and the power button right here on top why are these things zoom um, zoom looking like that and you could tell right here dolby vision atmos so you can unlock this two ways three ways actually you can unlock it with your pin and pattern and um, yeah, pin and pattern and face ID. So let's open it up real quick. Beautiful screen. Put in my information. All right. So this is what it looks like when you get it out the box. Nice and simple. It's, I'm, I'm not used to it. It looks weird. All of these apps comes with, I only, okay, let me just cut myself. You can, you can copy everything you have on your previous device onto this so a lot of the apps i had on my um old tablet i copy and put it on here like the playstation like the emulators as you see right here but out of the box it comes with like netflix and all these little things right here so for settings i just want to show you it's all about the tablet because i did a software update it's running miui 14 and um right here with android 13 boom okay system apps you can go into it you got features for tablets give you all the things right here you got floating windows connect device conference tools parallel windows a whole lot of stuff so you can do connecting and share i'm going to show you real quick these are things you can connect with it right there off the jump at the display you can do light mode or dark mode brightness level color scheme and refresh rate set at default i can also adjust it to anything you want you can leave it at default or you can um, select the, 
the, the rate of the ref refresh rate you want so right out the box is 60 and you can change it to one you can change it to 90 or 144 so since it's a 144 i'm just going to use the full thing 144 and for the sound and for the sound right here you can do something with the sound silent mode do not disturb additional sound effects right here when you got the headphone you got the virtual immersive sound like the eqs and all of that stuff when it wants to kind of get headphones to it and that's the one thing the graphic equalizer which i haven't messed with yet and these are the different eqs for the sound for the speakers and i'll just leave it as it is standard and it sounds very good let me get out of here so the main purpose of my tablet is to play games and watch a few videos and it does everything great especially the camera on this thing is not that bad but i'm just going to leave it for another time and beautiful thing is when i play a lot of games i like to use the dolphin emulator and i use it on a lot of tablets and it does not run so great but it run awesome on this tablet thanks to game turbo let me show you with game turbo real quick with game turbo every game that you download on a tablet is going to give it a boost so i got some emulators right here got a playstation 2 emulator which i haven't set it up properly yet i got the dolphin the snes and the epsx and when i go with the dolphin i just hit start play and it's going to give it a boost see boost successfully now when you start the game with this little sliding bar right here slide it over it's going to give you some options right here you're going to tell about boost and zoom in real quick for boost you can monitor the performance so let's go ahead and hit monitor performance and it's going to tell you what is running this is the fps that you're running before and after you can clear the memory you can free up storage you can do so much things you can screen record while gaming voice change and all that stuff this thing's a monster because of the snapdragon and this emulator runs very smooth on this tablet look how fast it is let me just do a quick gameplay of mario sunshine real quick So it's playable. It's very playable on um 1080p and it looks fantastic. There's no slow, there's no glitch or nothing. But I think the best resolution is keep it at um keep it at 720 and it still looks good at 720. So with 720, it'll be just fine. So let's go back into Mario real quick. It looks great. Let me try zooming with Mario. Is very fast, no slowdown, no glitch. This is crazy. And let me turn up the speaker a little bit. Great. Like I said, that was a brief review. So I'm going to spend some more time with it and do a full review. But I tell you the truth for a tablet, for gaming, this is great the only thing i wish in the packaging that would come with a screen protector it did not come with a screen protector unlike the budget one that i have and you have to buy a case so i'll grab this one right here from amazon which i'm going to use in a minute this one you can swivel and do all that stuff but anyhow this was a brief review of the xiaomi pad 6. it may not be the best review but i just did a quick one to show you some things about it so i'm going to spend some more time with it and then do another video about it all right this is jc thanks for tuning in catch you in the next one